imagine what the response will be hmm. when we all get to heaven. Not just black folk, white folk, people from all parts of the continent will be able to get together. Amen. Yes, sir. Amen. After we've gone through the process, the Lord's going to let us get together. We get together in part down here because we prophesy in part and we know in part. And that is perfect shall come. Then that which is done away shall be done in his name. Amen. Amen. Give our singers a great hand. We be thankful for our choir and our youth for their participation in this part of the service. I'm very grateful that the Spirit has led us to call Sister Johnson. Yes, sir. Amen. Yes, sir. What, what a day. Amen. Amen. What, what, a, what a day, brothers and sisters. You talking about a day. I've had some days in my life. I've been blessed tremendously. But that day when we see Jesus, hmm. that day when we see Him, we're going to raise it up enough. It's going to change from hallelujah to hallelujah. That means that we, go, we don't know what, what's going to happen beyond that. But one thing we'll know. Mm -hmm. We will be in the midst of the celebration. you got a problem celebrating here. Oh, great day. What about that day when we say, oh, see Jesus? Yes, sir. Amen. Don't you want to see Jesus? Man that died for us. A man that came that we might have a right to the tree of life. Amen. The man took all of the jeers, all of the rejection, and stood in our place. Amen. That we wouldn't have to stand there. He, he paid the price. Yes, sir. The ultimate price. Suffered that we wouldn't have to go through such excruciating pain. We can't stand a little pain now. Can you imagine pain that Jesus endured in order that we could just be saved by His grace? And that we're grateful unto the Lord, to the mistress, Mister of Ceremonies. Amen. You always win the oldest pride. Amen. The only way you couldn't win that I have to bring Sister Pauline Brown down here. She's 99. <laughs> but what, 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 a, what a life. Amen. 97 years old. The Lord has been good to us. Amen. Amen. Lengthen up the cords. 97 and still moving. Amen. He's, still, he's still in the right mind. I, I figure that he can still cook. Oh, yeah. Amen. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Bless the Lord. Bless the Lord. So we want to honor the angel of this house, Pastor Johnson. Give him a hand, ladies and gentlemen. talking about being in one place 31 years what would be the response of the people you just have to stand and having done all the stand just stand anyhow but know where you stand and for what reason you stand don't worry about opposition that's right that's right when you stand for Jesus he will stand his word yes he will but he said when he called us to preach, I'll be with you. He didn't say others would be with you. But he said, I'll be with you. And I'll be with you. Lord, you can't get high minded thinking that you are doing all of this, that you are all of this, and 35 bags of chip. All right. All right. Amen. It's the Lord. That's right. So we give glory unto the Lord. All that the Lord allows us to do. And then you have to thank the people that 
uh, support you. Yeah, Amen. Yeah. Amen. Those that are around you. God will always surround you with some people that will help uh, usher the kingdom in. Amen. Amen. And people that will support the work of the church yeah. and love you and they'll encourage you. They'll tell you every now and then, Pastor, we love you. Amen. Put their hand in your hand. Mm -hmm. Shake your hand. And you can feel it. And you can know it because it's true and it's real. You can't do anything by yourself. That's right. That's right. You need somebody to help you do whatever the Lord has called you to do. I don't know a bad preacher in the Bible that did everything by himself. Amen. God always put that remnant that, that would help do the work of the kingdom. Amen. Amen. That's what we're doing, brothers and sisters. It's the work of the kingdom. Amen. He's given us assignment to mm -hmm. do certain works in the kingdom. We need to be about our Father's business. Amen. To all of these other preachers that are here, uh, Kenneth Thompson, Dr. Jackson, Brother Spielman here, and we have several preachers with us. Brother Curtis, he's involved with you. He, matter of fact, he's everywhere. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Whatever you need, he's been taught to be all purpose. Amen. That's a Amen. blessing. Brother Jonathan, he's all purpose. You see, he get up from over here in the pulpit, and then he go over there and get on the drum. We have to look for him somewhere else because he's going to be doing something. Amen for the Lord and to our um, evangelists that are here, Minister Harbison. Do you yeah. See, God sends them out sometimes two by two. That's his wife over there. No, that's his wife. Let me get that right. <laughs> that's his wife over there. And Minister Riddick and the other ministers that are here, uh, Minister Thompson, Evangelist Thompson. God bless your heart. Each of you, our sisters and our brother Bishop Mary, with us this afternoon. All of you, our sisters and our brothers. Let me just take a few moments and cut through the cornfield. On my way through the cornfield, I'm going to pick a ear of corn. Amen. I'm going to put it on the stove. I'm going to roast it. And then we're going to eat it. And then we're going on home. Amen. But in the book of uh, Matthew, 